Hey everybody, uh, this is Clan Gamer here doing some post commentary for uh, uh, the Crash Bash Trophy and Gem Challenges. Now, the reason why I'm doing post commentary on here is because the um, uh, first two times I uh, tried to record this earlier today, uh, the, the first attempt, what happened was the commentary got screwed up in Audacity, and um, second time was that the well, I actually had a perfect run with the trophy and the gem challenges, but the computer decided. Oh, well, yeah, and I paused it here because uh, something was bothering me, and uh, I, uh, the computer decided to randomly shut down on me, saying, "Oh no, 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 you're you're not getting you're not getting that perfect run." Decided to freeze on me. Well, that's what I thought the computer was doing in a way, but it froze on me. Uh, but anyway, uh, the Skyballs uh, level is it's a good level, I think. It's a challenging level, to say the least, for, for Crash Ball. Out of all the Crash Ball arenas. And, um, let me just say right now, um, I'm potentially going to reveal who I'm going to be in the uh, uh, Crash Ball tournament mode uh, in my bonus videos, along with all the, the, all the fail montage out of all the other challenges that I did, or, or the adventure mode. But uh, I'm going to be... Uh, uh, it'll either be a flip a coin toss between the uh, uh, Koala Kong or Tiny, because they're both the same anyway. So either one of those two will be will be fine. But um, I don't know if it really counts on stats, uh, to be quite honest with um, uh, Koala Kong or Tiny. But uh, yeah, so that's who I'm going to be. But if if you if you think uh, stats count on this or not. Let me know in the comment section below, and um, uh, also I mentioned uh, in my uh, uh, two attempts at uh, recording this that uh, the Monday Night Raw review that I did um, uh, earlier this week, these are the last of my two reviews that I'm going to be doing regularly on YouTube. Um, because uh, because of my college course coming up, I'll be busy with the course and like with this content and stuff, so I may get a lot of homework to do. And, uh, so, yeah, and Friday Night Smackdown will be my last review that I'm going to be doing before, and, uh, if I, <coughs> if I have enough time, then I might just do, um, a recording of, uh, my Monday Night Raw reviews or Smackdown reviews, but, um, I might still be able to do my Smackdown reviews on the Saturday morning, but don't really count on that, because it might not happen, so... What I'll do is, uh, if I have enough time on a Saturday morning to do like a review of uh, uh, well, Smackdown, uh, I'll do it, but if I don't have enough time, then I'll just do it on my blog, because I'm going to be using it for college work anyway. So, I also mentioned in this video about the clan netbooks that I got um, uh, earlier uh, this month as well. I've been practicing uh, those for quite some time, and uh, my favourite tune out of all those books is uh, Bowlink's uh, um, Clan Sonata, the second movement, Romanza. I like this one because it's got the uh, uh, different dynamic uh, contrast to it. Well, dramatic uh, dynamic contrast. Because Romanza is like a well, romantic piece. And it's got like dramatic changes in the music. That's what uh, well, romantic is. It's like it's loud at first and then it suddenly gets quiet. And then loud again, it's like at unexpected times you hear the music getting loud and quiet, it's dramatic. Dramatic change. But anyway, um, so far in this trophy challenge, I mean, I did very well in this one. And uh, as you saw right there, I mean, I won two rounds in a row. And uh, I could possibly do it for three in a row, you'll just have to wait and see and find out. Um, now, I actually uh, did the rest of Warp Room 4, and yes, I did. this is me after doing all of Warp Room 4, and, um, quite honestly, all I can say is, in the Nitrous Oxide boss, I did the Oxide boss, and you'll probably see that uploaded uh, uh, soon in a couple of days, or a few days, and, uh, I don't know if any of you who have wa are watching this have encountered this glitch. After the loading music uh, is stopped, right, normally the music for Nitrous Oxide would be the Dot Dash music or Dingle Dial's theme remix from Crash Bandicoot 3. Well, that wasn't the case in this. It was the loading music again, except it was sp sped up. And honestly, 
I tried to commentate on on the boss and stuff, but due to the the glitch that happened, it kept distracting me. So that's a good excuse of why my commentary wasn't that up to scratch. And uh, as I won the trophy for uh, Skyballs, oh, I won the trophy for Skyballs. Sorry, I was meant to say because this is post commentary, not live commentary. Uh, this like, and I'll be going to be doing the uh, I did the gem challenge afterwards, and. Uh, I'm Yes, I, I got I got the, the trophy and gem challenges in my two attempts, but um, I decided to to do them again just to show you all how to get them. So, but be prepared for a bit of cutting here. Yeah, right there. And uh, yeah, I, I failed this challenge quite a few times. It was trying, starting to drive me to the brink of a craziness, and I was pleading with the game here. Well, I mean. The, well, I never did commentary on this because um, I couldn't be bothered going to go back to Audacity, just get rid of all the stuff I did before, and then half the, the video. So I decided, oh heck, you know what? I'll just give a post commentary and just be calm and stuff like that, and give my thoughts and on the level and stuff. But anyway, <coughs> gem challenge here was, was, as you saw right there, was basically the computers had 15 goals and. Uh, and I only had nine goals, so it was like defend the, your goal with the odds against you. Same with every other uh, crash ball, uh, well, gem challenge. And uh, yeah, so basically, basically that's all you do for this. And um, and I won the gem here after like so many attempts. But um, overall, I want to thank you all for subscribe subscribing to my channel. I've got 47 subscribers. If you can maybe make up to 50 subscribers for me, that would be brilliant. And um, thank you all for watching this. This is my post-commentary. Clan at Gamer here, and I'll see you soon. Bye.